Dang, that's really good. Morning YouTube. It is officially day two of Busco for me. It is gonna be such a good day out here. We are gonna do some really cool stuff with the quad today. I hope you guys are ready. I hope you guys killed the last video. I don't know if you guys did yet, but I'm sure you did. So we are gonna kick it into the intro and then I will see you guys at Busco Beach. So stay tuned. This is gonna be an insane video. I hope you guys enjoy. More people here today. Oh my gosh. Feels like a true bud bash now. Got all the PE rigs over there. We can pull into the vendor lot to see how everything's going today. Alright guys, we just made it to Busco. We went around, took a few pictures first, but we got the quad off. We got the dirt bike off. All we have left to pull out is the X3, which needs some work. I'm gonna have to leave it a PE after the event. Uh, I'm pretty sure the wheel bearings and the tie rod ends are just completely shot on it. But I do want to talk to you guys about two sponsors that are in on this video, and that is first and foremost, Heatwave Visual coming in clutch with some new shades. You see, you guys have seen me wear these a few times before. You guys have seen Ashlyn wear her new sunglasses. They look so good. I think those are her favorite pair she's had yet. You think so? Absolutely. So we've been wearing the Heatwave stuff, but we also just got another special package in. I don't have mine on yet. I'm gonna be wearing them later when we go riding around in the side-by-side. Ashlyn's got her brand new, already muddy, Gator Waiter boots on. And if you guys see, I think mine are right, yep, right here. Look at that, nice, clean, new Gator Waiter boots. So they actually sent us out a pair of waders each and a hoodie and t-shirt for us. So big shout out to Gator Waiters and Heatway Visual for hooking it up today. But that is not the primary purpose of today's video. We are gonna be getting the Suzuki LTZ 400 out today, and we're gonna test between what rides better out of Busco, the sand tires or the regular track tires. So I have a suspicion that with all the sand here at Busco, that the sand tires are gonna do really, really good. So I'm excited about that. I think first what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the 400 out, it's already warmed up, and we're gonna go ride the track and hit the drag strip with the stock tires on, see how it performs, see how it does, and then we'll come back swap over to the sand tires and rip with them on. I've never even ridden on sand tires, but I really do want some for the X3 too. That way when I take it out to Utah for the dunes, I think it'll be perfect. But I do plan on taking these sand tires out for Little Sahara out in the end of May for the LTZ 400. So right, let me get all geared up and I'll catch you guys on the GoPro. I Finally riding the old LTZ 400 officially at Mud Bash. Man, it is a freaking dust bowl out here, but I'm riding the LTZ 400. We got Ashlyn in the can and behind us. We're gonna go hit the track here for a minute. I'm excited to see how this thing does. I have not hit the track since the first day we rode it, and I've gotten a little more comfortable on it since then. So I'm pumped. I hope you guys are pumped. We're gonna go grab Kyle real quick. He said to head over there, so. And I hope you guys have been enjoying these Mud Bash videos. And look at the three-wheelers! I guess I can give you guys a little heads up on what I'm doing later this month. I will be driving out to Utah, bringing this, bringing Ashland CRF 125. And I think we're gonna make a few stops on the way. We might try to go see Weston, and we might try to go see Shred 80, Gavin. My guy, Gavin, the three-wheeler god, he is on the way out to Utah. So 
If you guys want to see us collab, leave it down in the comments. I'll be out there in like five minutes. All right, sounds good. All right, Kyle's gonna go put his small tires on. So we're gonna go get some few practice laps on here. Looks like they did groom it, however, so that's really, really cool. All right, you ready? on my tail. Oh my god, he's flying, dude. Holy shit. Oh my god, he almost died. Okay, this kid knows how to ride for sure. Back off of him a little bit, because I can't see a dang thing. Y'all left me some great comments in the last video about how to ride and stand up and everything like that. Definitely has helped me out riding on this thing a lot. That kid could rip. Whoever just passed me on that 450 could rip. at the least bit of speed man because I feel like I am flying today Woo! a serious amount of arm pump so much more natural on this thing than a freaking dirt bike dude what you think big dog i love this track <sighs> did it look like i'm going fast yeah okay cool you ready to rip what's up buddy yeah you ready to rip the drag strip all right we're gonna head down to the drag strip see how this thing stacks up against kyle's renegade that thing is fast but i have a feeling that we are going to be pretty quick too if we can get the jump on him if he's not in four wheel drive might get the jump on him a little bit but dang look at mud bash this year dude it is freaking packed dude uh, this is the fullest i've seen in a long long time i mean it is full to the brim the 50 50 hole there's people parked their trucks back there i mean it is totally slam full and we got all my friends out here too which has been awesome braden and kyle and garrett and luke and all of them they're here too and of course we got ashlyn out here you guys saw her in the last video she's out here with me we've just been cruising around having a great time at mud bash dude i have had such a dang good time today and there's still so much more to hide so we are gonna go drag race real quick and then put some paddle tires on this thing and see how it performs i'm pumped about that all right i gotta get a better start than that that was weak that was so weak i gotta get a better start all right let's try this one more time time god dang it <laughs> all right i gotta try first gear the whoever told me the second gear was a move i mean it's not a bad move but i just don't want to wreck the clutch 
That's good racing though, man. That's fun. I'm racing the KM 1000s, dude. Looking for a 400. I'm keeping up pretty decently. All right, let me race somebody like actual race quad. I want to run this guy. TRX 450 got nothing on this thing. Oh my gosh. Alright, so we are done eating. We just got done riding a little while ago. We ran and grabbed some food. We're gonna be putting on the sand tires and see how it handles the sand tires here at Busco. So we're gonna swap these over real quick, gas it up, and then we're gonna take the side by side and take it to the track. So I'm pumped. I wanna see how it performs versus the regular tires, which it's done really good today, honestly. But we'll need to find a air pump so we can pump these up and then we should be good. So stay tuned, let's get these tires changed over. Have you gone down in there yet? I haven't even ridden it yet. Oh I yeah, you gotta just go, like, take it down uh, right across, mess around in that, it's soft sand. Yeah. Get a feel for it. Dude, you're gonna have fun with this. What do you think, bud? Let's put battles on it. Ride it. <laughs> I'll take it out. You think it's gonna work pretty good? <laughs> I mean, we're at Busco Beach, there's a lot of sand. Yeah, it's gonna work. Yeah, are those stiff or what? Yeah, that's stiff. What you think? Where'd you get those? On Facebook Marketplace. Nice. Yeah. All right, let's put the Saints the speed glove on. Big shout out to them again for helping us out today's video. Are you ready? Let's do it. All right, big shout out to Kyle for the pump. I'm gonna go put this in his secret hiding place. I wish we could have ripped the can am a little harder this time, but it needs some love for sure. All right, front tires feel a little weird. Definitely not used to the front tires. Oh my, okay. I have a lot of traction. Maybe too much. Okay, the front end's really different. I'm not used to that at all. But it works. Really, really well. It's like a jet ski. I don't have any traction whenever I'm off the gas. Dude, there's so much fun to slide though. Oh my God, I'm already out of breath again. Dude, did they eat though? So these sand tires are actually really, really cool. I'm interested in riding them in actual like sand dunes and stuff at the end of the month. But man, I think these are really, really good for, for the sand track for sure. I did want to skim it. Guys, I know, I know it would be sick to skim this thing, but I don't see, I, all the spots that I had picked out for it are totally filled up. The bus goes like way over packed for skimming right now and I think I need to do it at a little a place that's way less busy so maybe we'll bring this back out whenever it's way less busy and skim then I think if we got 10,000 likes I know that's asking a lot 10,000 likes I'll bring this back we'll skim it on the water with the paddle tires and if you guys are ready for some more paddle tire content I'm gonna bring me I'm gonna be bringing this out to the dunes at the end of the month and I hope you guys are ready so leave a like on this video if you guys want to see that because I think it'd be so freaking great. And I just really think you guys like the quad content. I think doing the dunes in the desert is going to be something really special for you guys. So stay tuned for that. I would take it to the drag strip, but they have packed that thing down. It's not even sand anymore. That's it. I hope you guys have enjoyed the Mud Bash videos. We are done filming though. I hope you guys have liked a little bit different style from Mudbash. That was so much fun. 
I cannot wait to go to Utah with these tires. It's going to be an absolute blast. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. I'm going to end it off here. We're going to go meet the family for dinner, and then we're going to come back out here and cruise around. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're ready for more. I'll see you guys next time. So you guys have pretty cool shots? I think so. Cool. Honestly, I kind of my eyes closed for a lot of it. But <laughs> I think I got some pretty cool shots. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to put that in. <laughs>